So hi dear Virgo, a very very good morning to you guys. This is Anjali Taro and this is a journal of reading for all the Virgo Sun, Moon, Venus rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the rules can be reversed also. Third thing, this is a reading from today till the 1st of uh, September for those who are in complete no contact or no communication and wants to know what's going on on the other side, okay? If it is not resonating, it's not your story, you can just skip the video. Please keep in mind the rules can be reversed also any time of the reading because energies are fluid. Okay, if you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box for the same. If you want to start your self-healing journey with Ho'oponopono but don't know from where to start, you can definitely start by purchasing my masterclass. Again, the link is in the description box for the same and it has the power to change your life for the rest of your life. Trust me on that. I'm doing it for a very, very long time now. And if you want one-on-one -on -one healing sessions or personal readings, you can check out the description box and you can mail me for the same. So let's start. Okay, honey Virgo, let's see. The person that you have no contact or no communication with, just give me a second. Yeah. Stop. Fine. Fine. This person is trying their best to let you go out of their life, out of, the, out of their system, out of their energy, cutting the cords with you, detaching from you. It's like now this person is feeling like seeing things from a different perspective, from a different angle. And now this person is setting you free, trying to set you free as an energy, trying to set themselves free as, a, as an energy. I think this person right now is very much focused on this kind of energy of having a long-term partnership, a commitment and or marriage kind of deal with or without you. See, this person is keeping this option open to have, uh, have something solid on the table with you. But as of now, this person is letting you go. Okay, So they are right now in this energy of having uh, this energy of uh, taking care of themselves as much as they, they can. Loving, compassionate, nurturing kind of energy towards everything and everyone. At the same time, keeping their options open and heading towards something that, that's making sense to them at this present moment. Because according to them, they're heading towards something meaningful, something long term, something that's going to give them this... Uh, uh, secure and safe kind of environment so as of now energetically they're letting you go heading towards something or someone that's giving them this this kind of feeling of giving them something stable on the table kind of a deal okay so yeah at the same time they're not fully letting you go they are keeping this option open that might be you are the one for them but might be the timing is off so they're exploring their options or at least trying to so that they can uh, be with the one who's meant for them okay cool let's see what this person wants from you yeah. let's see what this person wants from you what are their intentions for the situation between you and them honey the strength card the seven of wands the six of pentacles the bottom of the deck is the five of cups this person doesn't want to show, show you any kind of emotion at all zero percent emotion they want to hold back they want to keep themselves protected they want to keep themselves in this energy bubble they want to uh, i think right now this person wants to balance their own energies balance their own emotions balance their own life i think they're struggling through some kind of uh, money job career uh, financial issues as well they're trying to uh, manage that and they're very much focused on their pentacles on their money their, their job their career balancing their uh, energies out kind of energy kind of a deal so they're holding back they want to hold back they want to keep themselves protected they want to keep themselves in an energy bubble and they want to be in this energy of balancing their own life getting getting their shit together instead of focusing on love and relationship they're very focused on money job career even if it hurts they don't want to do much about love and relationship area not with you only but with anybody as of now they want to get out of this pain they want to get out of this feeling regret about uh, certain things uh, feeling guilty about certain things about this situation regret or guilt whatever however it uh, like uh, it resonates with you but they want to balance their own shit to get their own shit together and keep their mouth shut and working behind the scenes on themselves let's see what action is this person going to uh, oh my god what is wrong with me let's see what action is this person going to take towards you if any by the what we have first of september We have a six of cups, a ten of pentacles, king of pentacles, bottom of the deck is a two of swords. No action card from this person's side. Missing you like crazy, missing all the good times, missing this energy of what could have been between you guys, but not doing anything about it. They are going to be continuously in this energy of thinking about you, missing you like crazy, missing all the beautiful memories, missing all the good kind of energy, especially if you have kids. 
this person is going to miss the energies that you guys used to spend with your kids together or if you guys were committed or married to each other this person is going to miss you a lot but i don't think this person is going to take any kind of action from this their, their side again this person is very much focused on money job career they are going to be completely closed off not towards you or only to uh, to everyone else in a romantic way so because of the past memories they are not able to let you go completely out of their life out of their system they still care about you they still care about the situation they still care about your well being they are still compassionate about you they are still compassionately um blessing you with all of their heart and soul so it's like they are closed off they are like a closed book i don't see them taking any kind of action but missing you missing all the memories all the good times that you guys had with each other yeah let's see what we have uh like uh, as a guidance for you guys vogo two of swords i think the universe wants you guys to stay away from each other at least for the time being okay if you guys are not sure vogo i'm talking about you if you guys are not sure about the future direction of the situation and you don't know what you should do don't do anything about it just take your time understand what you really want out of this particular person or situation and then only take the action in the future if you want to otherwise just let this chapter go slowly but surely and keep moving forward okay so don't make any kind of uh, decision permanent decision in this confusion because this confusion is temporary okay this phase is temporary cool so yeah thank you so much for tuning in virgo i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you